we are uh, well above 60 degrees north um, and we're going to go ahead and make a GPS point of this spot where the area started to just now break up a little bit. But uh, we've had it with us for the whole trip. It's pretty amazing. I jumped out of the truck real quick to get some shots. Didn't realize the wind was blowing this hard. And uh, I'm a little underdressed right now. And <laughs> it's cutting through me big time. out here on the Dempster this fine morning. But we're in this tombstone range and these mountains are surrounding the road right now and it's the, the photography is spectacular. Well worth getting out here in the, the cold wind. We've got some oncoming traffic here that's probably gonna think we're kind of insane walking around out here because Scott took off down the road so there's no vehicle in sight. <laughs> So they're going to think it's just a couple nuts with cameras walking down the highway here. <laughs> Hope Scott gets back pretty soon. It's getting cold. Now it sucks to be out here without that truck right now. And just these clothes. I think I would be dead in short order. <laughs> this is incredible. Yeah, it's absolutely amazing. That valley. I, and I wasn't, beautiful. yeah, I wasn't expecting the mountains, you know, this big on this road. I mean, we're pulling a pretty good grade right now. We're at 15 degrees outside right now, and uh, the wind is blowing pretty good. Um, the road actually has pretty decent traction right now, I think from everything being so cold. Um, the tires are still got a lot of grip, but we are taking it easy. We don't want to, we've seen a couple uh, places where <clears throat> water has broken through the side, through the uh, mounds of snow on the side, the water's broken through and, and pooled out onto the road and created these little mini ice lakes um, on the highway here. So we're really watching out for those because uh, they come up on you quick and they're and the way that they're shaped, you can easily catch a tire on, on an edge and slide start sliding sideways a little bit. down to six degrees now. Yeah, as soon as you open that window, instantly you feel, I mean, it's just a rush of cold air. Yeah. Here we are, Chris, coming into Eagle Plains. Halfway point. on the road conditions for being open or? Well, I, I'm not sure. Of, uh, uh, the white is here, but no, it's not okay.
We're here at the uh, Arctic Circle. Uh, we left Eagle Plains uh, about uh, 45 minutes, 50 minutes ago. Uh, we're making good time. The wind is starting to pick up and the road conditions are starting uh, to worsen a little bit. Uh, Visibility is dropping at times. Um, certainly the wind chill is, is up there right now. I can feel it on, uh, on my face. But we're really excited to be here. We're, uh, this is one of the milestones of the trip. Very exciting time for us right now. We finally made it to the Arctic Circle. It is really cold. <laughs> oh, even my eye, just to take a take a picture with my eye open, it starts to burn. <laughs> Man, that is cold out there. You got, your sunglasses are all fogged up, though. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta take a picture of me. Where? Inside the truck? No, it's by the side. Oh, man. All right. You taking it out the window? No, I'm ready. I'm not coming in on a circle without a picture. I'm game. <laughs> 